Hello everyone, me to back again with another video and today I'm gonna be showing you the basement. This is actually my um grandparents' mother my grandparents' mother's basement, which actually also belongs to one of my dad's friends. So, so today I'm gonna be showing you it. Firstly though, we gotta go and open it up. As you can see it's locked up here. It's locked up here, and it's also locked down here. Now, first of all, the, the bottom one's really easy. All you gotta do is remove the wood, move this back, like so, and then put the wood back in so we do not lose it. This is absolutely mandatory, because if you lose the wood, you're not gonna be able to close it up. Now, the door should open, right? Nope. You can actually see it's also attaching on there. So yeah, now the, so the door is not preventing from opening. But, there is a little gap for, an, for air to go through. So, all we need to do is disattach that, let it dangle, and then we can finally open it, like so. Perfect. Now we finally closed it up. I mean, we opened it, sorry. There's also another one, which I'm going to show you. First, let's go move this. Here. Let's just go move this. Here. Let's just go move this. Move this one out of the way. Whoa. I don't want that falling. Move this. Good. And now we can open this one. First thing you want to do is you want to go take this metal piece, turn around, put it back in, so it will not distract it, and you got to just pry it open. There we go. See? That's how you open it. But sadly, we can't open it all the way due to this being in the way and that. So, anyways, now we can go close on this side. Like that. Good. Now that it's closed, what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to go put this back, put all these things back. Without it, um, uh, so I'm gonna put this, put all these things back, and I'm gonna go put that middle thing in later. So for now, I'm just gonna go and disattach it, and I'm gonna go and attach it onto here, like that. So that's where the metal is going to be. So you can see the metal goes up here, and that's what holds the door in place. For now, though, it's actually gonna stay open, so I just wanna make sure we push it all the way. Actually, I'm just gonna leave it open, like that. Where is she? There, just push it down, push it tight. Now, as you can see, look at all these bags. That's all the bags underneath the swimming pool. Now we can open it up like this. And as you can see, we got plastic. A plastic like that. That is wet. That's is actually wet. And that actually, actually freezing cold in here. See, look at that. That's all. That's all ice, and my hands are now wet. So got some ice cream in there. Actually, still a decent amount, a decent amount of room left. Spinach, bread. Wait, why is there bread here? <laughs> why is there bread here? I don't know. I don't know. Sir. Anyways, let's go and close this up. Good. Give it a firm tug. Now I can go close up these two things here. As far as they will go. Good. See. And on, however, guys, on the outside of this, we actually got flies. And on the outside of that, there's actually like a ton of wasps. And also, here yeah, these windows are pretty much thick. And also, I actually see a little metal bar right there. So yeah, pretty sure this is not sure you can open up the other part of the windows. So it's pretty nice. We got a little extension cord right there. A coat hanger. What is that doing up there? I see another coat hanger right there. Actually, I see a bunch of them. We also got a umbrella here with a spider web on it and I have no idea why would you connect this to your saw buddy whatever here we got a Texas Hold'em Texas Hold'em casino box we got more umbrellas here baby wipes diapers uh, oil cans we also got some toolboxes in here so it's got like a mechanical workshop we also got this pencil with a baseball and a football, a football on it. We also got a JVC. Wonder what is this doing here? But the thing I'm wondering the most is what is in here? Oh, just nuts. Nuts and bolts. What I'm really concerned, why is this here? Let's see if there's any batteries in there. Nope. No batteries. So it's pretty nice. 
See, it says VCR. You can TV. Very nice, and for sure that's a fly. There's also a mug right there. So, two juice boxes. Wait, are these? 24, 24, so these are actually tomato, not juice boxes. I don't know why I said juice box. <laughs> I don't know why I said juice box. And yeah, we also got a bunch of other equipment. So yeah, now it's time to exit and close this place up. But before we do that, here's what it looks like on the inside with the door closed. As you can see, this is what it should look like. I'm not going to close it up all the way because then I'm not going to be able to come out. So, first thing well, what we want to do is we want to take this metal piece here. I'm gonna go and take it, attach it in to the hole like that. Make sure you give the door a firm push to make sure it's seated. And now, if we try opening the door, it's not letting us. It's pretty nice. Next up is the door. So, right here, we got this. So, you guys, we got this here. All right, see? We still got this middle wire. I don't know what that is for. But it's pretty nice. Here's the wood that we'll be using. It's actually jammed in there. We also got this bolt because there's like no door here. So in case we want to close it, we can use this. Sure, we can use this, but maybe we can't. Maybe we can't. We also have this. We also have this thing here, so it's pretty nice. Anyways, let's go and close it up. Actually, wait, let's go move this back. And let's go and close it up now. I'm going to move that piece of wood there. Because now what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to give this a firm pull. Because if I just do it like this... Maybe it will not be enough. You can actually see. I'm pretty sure it can go more than that. So, what we want to do is we want to make sure this is going to go firm pull. So, we're just going to go and firmly pull it. There we go. You see some nuts attached. Maybe. Pull it. There you go. Next, now we can go and close it up. So, first we can go take this metal piece. Actually, wait. Let's first go and take... You can actually see it's trying to open if I go and like attach this here as you can see it's still not gonna be enough If I try like fiercely opening it like that and I'm pushing the door like that It, it will connect but you can actually see It's not holding it down all the way so let's go and disconnect that again There Pull this There let's hope that's connected now it's going to reattach this back. Good. Still on hold. There are more cycle noises. Push this down. Pull it. Yeah. Now we can go and attach this metal hook. To be honest, it's not even needed because you can actually see it's not like firmly attaching onto it, but whatever. It's a, it's a requirement, so why not? We also got this metal ring, which I know what it's doing here. But I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure there's actually like limits. The adjusting, I'm pretty sure. It was like that. And then this attaches on here and then gets pulled on. No. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. So we'll put this metal ring back. So let's go and attach this here. And now, we got the door from Tug. Now, you can't open it anymore. See? That's pretty nice. Now, I'm actually going to show you what it actually looks like when it's attached. So, I'm going to take this, push it here, just like this, put the wood piece back in, pop it open, and look. Ugh. This takes a while. Luckily, I'm going to have this metal piece as our prying tool. I hope I do not regret this. So, I'm going to push this door here, kind of like that, as you can see. So, that's how it will look like closed. And now, to open it from the inside, we can actually go and take this. So it's like kind of like an emergency thing. You put it there. See like what I look at? Bang, see? You can pry it open like that. See? Pretty nice. It's like an emergency tool. Anyway, let's go and lock this door up. Like that. And now what I actually want to try doing is... This safety support? Wait, is this safety support? Yeah, it is. So you're going to see my face after a while. Hey guys, in my face. Hope it's not ugly. If you think it's ugly, I'll block you. But yeah, see? So, now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna close this door up. But however, the camera. Recording that. The camera's gonna be recording this. The camera's going to be recording me closing the door. So, yeah, my, the camera's gonna be 
recording me closing the door, so yeah. And then you guys are going to see what it looks like when it's completely closed. And I'm also putting the wood back and also that little metal thing, so. Anyways, let's go do that now. So first we're gonna close the side, and then I'm probably, you're probably not gonna hear me anymore. So, I'm being a bit louder than usual. Put this up, take the wood, close it up, put it in, and there we go. Yay, now the door's barricaded. Now I'm gonna go open it up again. Open it up. First we're gonna take out the wood, move this, put the wood back in. Move the thing, door open a bit, move it forward, this is how you can open it. See? Hope you guys heard me. I hope you guys heard me. Hope you guys heard me. So I hope you guys heard me. If you guys didn't, then put your volume up. And if you still do not hear me, well, then I've made this video for absolutely no reason. I made that thing for no reason. But now it's actually time for us to close this. So, I'm gonna get it. We're gonna go out. It's I just actually for an extra bit of safety precautions. Let's also go move that. How do I get now? Let's go close this up. Good. Now we can go and this is that move the wood, put this back, put back the wood, and we can go and take this. Let's attach it back. I guess I don't know why, but it's in just an extra safety precaution, like I said. There we go. Now it's locked in place. There's also another one over here, but. I don't know if it counts as a door. We also got a broken light switch. Broken light switch. There's also no door. So, yeah. So you can definitely see what's going on here. There's a bunch of toys. Wait, is that a... What is that? Hmm, I wonder what that is. I have to go show my dad, but anyway. Goodbye.